All three of the main characters of Mau Mau, Heroes of Pure Heart, have been growing over the course of the show so far. Mau Mau and Badger Clops have been mostly growing as people. They were already very experienced adventurers before the show started, so they're already really good in a fight. Adorabat, however, started the show as a sweetie pie who had never known danger and is learning how to become a hero. Since the title song is sung from her perspective, I thought it would be fun to take a look at just how much she's grown over the course of the first 28 episodes. Also, I just like her for some reason. Violence! Wow! Huh. Haven't figured out why. In the very beginning, Adorabat doesn't even fight. Her shining moments in the first episode are when she's able to fly super fast, though we do get to see her first effective combat move, flying away from enemies chasing her until she tricks them into hitting something. You're asleep now. Once she's managed to impress Mau Mau enough to join the Sheriff's Department, though, we get a few episodes where she's overshadowed by her two far more experienced mentors. In the beginning of No Shortcuts, she just can't keep up with Mau Mau and Badger Clops, throwing smoke bombs to no effect and only accidentally getting Raymorap to hit a snake. She does, however, gain experience from the encounter, and is able to confidently execute the same maneuver by the end of the episode. In Mau Mau's bike adventure, she's able to handle herself against Raymorap, dodging her attacks, continuing to lead her into hitting things, and generally being as adorable as her name suggests. I'm blinding you! She's also part of Team Attacks, getting into position to trap a snake in a net after Mau Mau hits him. Against a monster, however, a doorbat still isn't very useful. When fighting the Impressor, the best thing she can think to do is deploy a bunch of army man toys to distract it. And while it does distract it for a moment, she's also lucky she didn't get blasted in the back. When fighting isn't necessary though, Adorabat shows she has the smarts to deal with the monster. The blob from Enemy Mime was immune to Mau Mau's fighting, and Badger Clops' charm only ended up getting himself, and everyone else, captured as well. But with a well-executed magic show, Adorabat was able to save the day. Yes, she did want to do a magic show all along, but by the time she used it on the monster, she had figured out the secret to freeing her friends and vanquishing the monster. Also, she understood the secret to keeping Pinky locked up as long as possible. By the time Sick Mao happens, she's become a lot better at outright fighting monsters. She's able to knock Badger Clops out of the way of an ice blast, come up with a decent plan, and use her smoke bombs as effective distractions. Plus, she's just very enthusiastic. Ace the pain! <laughs> Even when the monster comes back with a vengeance, she's still able to fly effective distraction against it and use her smoke bombs to get herself out of trouble. He got me too. Mostly. Finally, Adorabat's been learning stealth from Mau Mau. She was just learning in Captured Clops, but by the next episode, Boust and Show, she's able to knock out two of the King's Guards at once. Excellent, form Adorabat. That's just the first 28 episodes. The first season isn't even over, and Adorabat has already learned a lot. Just like in the theme song, Mau Mau was teaching her to be a hero like him, and Adorabat is a very good student.